Hello everybody, Andrea Maeski here with Dental Tutoring. So I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about if you are stuck in a rut and you need something new to study, if there's a certain topic, um, topic that you want to study more of, if you just simply have a question and think, oh, I wonder what Andrea thinks about this or um, what can I do about this situation whether you're working in the office or a student still in school if you just simply have questions well i've probably talked about it before on my channel um, i've had my youtube channel not forever actually i'd say only the past couple years i've been tutoring now for almost 14 years but um youtube became popular i don't even know how long ago but i didn't quite jump on that bandwagon until about two years ago maybe three years ago now um, but now I'm doing a YouTube video at least once a week, if not more. If I have students email me with questions, sometimes I find it just easier to do a whole um, video on it because if everybody has the same question, it just makes sense to talk about it, right? Plus, I want patients at some point to be able to do a search for, um, I have gingivitis, what do I do? I have perio, what do I do? So I've been making... Um, videos also for patients so that I'm not talking in our technical language all the time. But having all of that said, I want you guys to have a look at my YouTube channel and do a search for something that you need help with. So let me just share my screen here and I'll just kind of show you guys what I mean. So um, if you guys go to my YouTube channel, so it's youtube.com um, slash user slash um, dental L. Okay, so that's it, and then you will see everything right there. Um, so as an example, so I just kind of popped up the first um, video that came up, probably because I just did this one June the 27th, so it's still pretty new. But if you guys do a search, now I don't think I'm on my channel, so let me just actually go on my channel, and then that way you can search within the channel. So if you kind of, now I don't know what pops up for you guys because I'm I'm obviously the maker of the channel, but oh here it is. So if you guys do a search, so let's say you had a question on um, medical emergencies. So you guys can type in medical emergencies and then any videos will pop up. Okay, so let's just say, oh well, this isn't really a medical emergencies video. So you know what? Clearly I had to do a video on medical emergencies because I'm going to make a note of that because I don't have one on there for the public. Now, I do tutor my students every week, so I know I have some medical emergencies in a private um, link for them. So if you become um, a Dental L member, so if you're either a student still in school um, or if you're prepping for the board exam, you can become a Dental L member. So they have a medical emergencies video, I'm pretty sure. I think they have at least two or three. But if you do a search in my channel, they will show you, um, all of the searches will show you all of the public ones that I have. So let's just do a search for dental hygiene. And then, so you just have to do a search here and then all of the keywords for dental hygiene will pop up. Um, so loops is a good example. I had a lot of questions from people um, asking about the kind of loops that I like. Um, I've had about three different pairs of loops in the past, some I loved and some I hated. So I did do a video on that. So if you just click that, then you can watch. Um, I do try to keep the videos short and sweet, so not too long. Um, and then another good example, as I can see on the right hand side here, is where I talk about perio. So if you guys have questions about perio, um, the different case types, um, in fact, I have another video here, as you guys can see, where I talk about all of, um, all of the different types of pockets. So a lot of the videos are for your knowledge as a student or as a dental hygienist or as a dental assistant, but also how to explain things to your patients. Because especially as a new dental professional, you might not know how to explain to a patient that they're about to lose all of their teeth and they need to get this, you know, worked on, right? So I do um, talk a lot a bit, um, a lot about that as well. Um, another one I talked about learning the tooth surfaces. So that's more so for the dental hygiene student and the dental assisting student who are just starting school. 
but I have literally talked about almost everything. You know, I've talked about the good, the bad, the ugly. Um, if we look at this title here, so why dental hygiene school sucks, but here's how you can push through it. So I even talk about that. Um, and this one's even from 2016. So I've been doing the videos now for a while. Actually, I remember that this was one of the first videos that I done um, the mock exam questions for dental hygiene and dental assisting students for the exam because I was in Ottawa at the time studying for restorative hygiene so this was in 2015 yeah so I've been doing it now for about three years so and this one has over 10,000 um, people who have looked at it wow that's a that's a lot of people right but anyways guys so I just kind of wanted to show you um, what you can do to look at everything because um, I've talked about almost everything so far but if you guys um, are looking for a video that's not on here let me know and then I will talk about it because I'm always looking for some ideas because I do do videos every week and the videos are dependent on what people ask me um, the types of questions people ask me if they need help with something then I talk about it um, I've talked about things from me being in school and having horrible teachers. I've talked about how I, I had to take the dental hygiene program twice. So I've talked about everything. Um, and make sure to hit um, subscribe as well. So then that way, every time I do upload a video, which is at least once a week, you will know. So yeah, you guys. So I hope you guys um, keep on watching. Thank you so much. And again, that's youtube.com user slash dental l and if you guys need anything please just always let me know and thank you guys for watching and i will see you very soon